complete and utter dream job for you, isn't it? This is like yeah, almost yeah, yeah. Like uh, as the soon as ultimate. it came through, my agent rung me with it. And to be honest, it was really bad timing because Busted were about to record an album. We we're kind of in this kind of um, period. And, but this came through and I was like, this is actually a dream job for me. <laughs> you know, so I auditioned and I was so lucky to get the part. It's, um, it's amazing. Like, I was such a big fan of this movie when I was growing up and I'm, I've never actually seen the stage production. And it's so much darker and weirder and more interesting than you think it is. It's just, it's just fascinating. Yes, yeah, so the movie, the Steve Martin is playing. Mm. Your yeah. part, obviously, as yeah. well. Um, so, yeah, leader of the plaque, as yes. we like to yes. call your, nice, your nice. role. Yeah, nice. <laughs> I used nice. to love like it back it. in the day. The movie yeah. was fantastic. It's great, isn't it? It's such a it's such a feel good musical. Like the the music is special. Like it really is. It's like a good you. stint for the park. Yeah. Like it's nice. I mean, there's there's something about doing it outdoors as well. Like it just brings a totally different element because you've mm. got them. Um, you know, and I, and I love the fact that you've kind of got this this kind of weather thing to deal with as well, you know, in, in Britain, you know, and right now we're having this amazing... I was just going to say, you better put thing. sunscreen on as well. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. Well, I'm in leathers most of the time, oh, so, you gosh. know, I'm going, I'm going to be sweaty. But it's, um, it's, just, it's just beautiful. Like, the change of from light to evening is just beautiful for the show. Like, it really is. And it's, um, you know, plants and we're in the park and it's... it's it feels special. real, doesn't it? Yeah. You ended up in A&E, didn't you? I did. <laughs> Rehearsal yeah. last week. Yeah. Some bang to the head. <laughs> I know, we were kind of, we are doing a stagger through of Act Two and I kind of, a, I have a very quick change. So I had to run off stage and get into something, run back on. And I just banged my head really hard and kind of fell to the ground, kind of stumbled on stage and just felt blood dripping down my face. Oh, and they were like, I think we have to stop the show. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, um, but they glued me up, I'm all good. You're all good. I'm all okay. good. I'm okay, on the mend, on the mend. Yeah. Okay, well, that's, we're so looking forward to it. I mean, it's funny because you, you are so synonymous with, with music and busted. And like that's mm. when I think of you, I think of that. But acting yeah. was something you always wanted to do. That was kind of number one, really. Yeah, to be honest, I'm still kind of, um, I'm still really shocked and, and amazed that I do music for my job. Like, it never really, like, I never really meant to be a musician. Like, it was just kind of something that me and my mate wrote these silly songs about school teachers and the future, <laughs> and it just kind of busted happened. And then it didn't happen. And I went back to acting, which I love and is, is kind of my real passion in life. And then busted's come back again. It's just like, it's just amazing. It's just fantastic. And there's new music coming out next year? Yeah, we just literally, we just finished album four, which, um, which is the best we've ever done. Like it's kind of um, it's kind of the album we've always really wanted to make, and it's um, it's a really it's I think busted fans are gonna really dig it. All right, yeah. I look forward to it. Yeah. Being yeah. one myself, Matt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to also say congratulations on your tenth wedding anniversary. Yeah. And you decided not just to go for dinner or any of that business. No. You just thought, let's do a proper party again. <laughs> yeah, literally, literally. I remember the day after we got married, Emma said to me. She was devastated that the wedding was over because she planned it for such a long time. And she was kind of, she was really upset. And she was like, we're coming back here in 10 years and we're going to do it all again. I was like, all right, fine. You know, it's kind of just putting it to the back of my mind. Every year she'd be nine years left, eight years left. You know, and suddenly it was like last year, she was like, right, so party time. I was like, oh, we're doing this. Okay, cool. You know, set the tone for the day. And England won the football. Oh. And it was just a really amazing day. And then we had... Um, uh, like we formed a little covers band at the end, me and some mates, and then McFly played at the end. It was just a really fantastic evening. I love the idea that all the girls wore their wedding dresses. Yes, yeah, I fun, thought right? that was just brilliant. Yeah, I mean, yeah. ten years later, if I get into my wedding dress, yeah, I'll be yeah, really yeah, happy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. they all looked so fantastic, and it was, just, it was just a party, wasn't it? It was just it was something so... that you'd wanted to do. Yeah, we just wanted to make it the most fun day possible. We're like, how can we make sure that everyone just has the greatest time possible? So we yeah. put everything in place to to hopefully do that, and I think. Our best. You did. You did it well. Yeah. What did your children think about it? Oh, they loved it. They, uh, they absolutely loved it. Like it, that, that was kind of what I think was so special about it because Ace was my best man, you know, and he was there. He got the ring out and stuff. He was oh fumbling with it. He was getting a bit nervous, but it was just, um, oh, it was just a really special moment. It was wicked. Oh, fantastic! Yeah. Well, send Emma all of our love, and I if will, she's had a busy time, the Voice Kids and everything else. Yeah. I can see you being on the Voice Kids. It's one of our coaches. You know that. Yeah, Danny I'll be does an it so brilliantly. Mess. I watch that program and I'm in flood of tears, I can't deal with it. So I'm being there in person. I can't even watch it. I can't even go to watch it because I'd just be like, be would you like to do something like that though? You'd be so brilliant at it. Yeah, I think I'd. Um, yeah, I think I'd. I, I, I would maybe. Maybe yeah. one day. We'll see. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Matt. Like thank we say, you. Little Shop of Horrors, Regent's Park Open Air Theatre, 3rd of August. It yeah. all kicks off. Thank you Best very of much. luck. Come down. Thanks. We will. Thank you. Thank you.